All right, welcome to my How Is It Reactive series. In this episode, I'm going to be covering the brand new skin called Trench Trawler. So as you can see, this is what he looks like. Probably one of the weirdest looking skins in the game. He's got basically a lighthouse helmet for a head. Something about his neck rubs me the wrong way. I don't know. It just doesn't look right. It's creepy to me. And then at first I thought that was his skin around his neck. But look at his arms. They're a completely different color than the neck. So my son Jack says that's sand. But I don't think that's true either. I don't know. But anyway, the reactive message says eyes light up at night. So that's pretty self-explanatory. However, you can't see what it looks like on this screen. I mean, you can barely see the light glowing, but of course this is in the light. We need complete darkness. So I'm gonna test this out and show you exactly what happens, and then you can decide whether he's worth 1200 V-Bucks or not. Now, unfortunately, his back bling, the anchor, is not reactive, nor is his pickaxe, the heavy hook. So it's only the skin itself. So normally I have my son Jack test this with me, but he does not have this skin. He didn't buy it, nor did he get gifted it. So I went on Twitter and I just asked for anyone that bought the skin to post their epic name. And I just picked somebody randomly. So I'm going to get a guy in here. He's going to help me test because the problem is you can't see the face from your perspective. Obviously, we only see from the backside. So having another person with this skin will help me see exactly how it's reactive. All right, we're scratching that. I thought I was going to be nice and have people help me out from my community, but it backfired tremendously. I just wasted 15 minutes. The first guy I added said he had the skin. That was the whole point of my tweet. I said, who has the skin? I added him as a friend. I get him in the lobby and look in the bottom left. He says, I don't have the skin. He didn't have a mic either. So I tweeted out again. I got another person to reply. I send him a DM on Twitter, and then he says he has to go. So why did he say he could help me in the first place? I don't know. And then another person DM me and said, a thousand percent, I have the skin. I sent him a message, asked him for his epic, and he never replied. So whatever, I'll just do it myself. We'll just take a peek. So here we go. I kind of made a pirate-themed loadout, including the glider here. Whoa. Was that my glider that did that? Oh, it is. Wow, there's like a explosion that comes off of that. That's cool. Okay, so the skin itself is kind of weird. I'm not going to lie. That helmet really throws me off. He's got like a buoy hooked to his butt. I guess it's on his belt, actually, not his butt. And then he's all built. Like, he's super muscular, too. It's just strange. So, it is nighttime out. Let's get underneath a tree. See, you can't really see anything from this perspective it doesn't look reactive at all i see no glow from the front even from the top down angle i see nothing isn't that weird this is the reactive feature something you'll never even see i'm going to do the primo moves because that spins me around a second there it is wow look at how almost non-reactive that is i was expecting like super high beam glow from the headlights on the front there, but I mean, that is barely noticeable. And it's not noticeable at all to you, the player. That is disappointing. This is not worth 1200 V-Bucks. This is probably the worst reactive skin I've ever seen. Maybe it's not working right. Maybe something's up. I mean, it's definitely nighttime. Yeah, like from this angle, I thought you'd see like the big light beams shooting out you know the high tractor beams coming out and instead you see nothing so from your perspective it's not reactive at all how dumb is that let's do old school see him turn around yeah i mean it's just barely glowing so disappointing now let me go into a day match and we'll see if they just don't light up at all let's see all right so here we are in the daylight let's do old school turn him around Oh yeah, it's even worse now. Obviously, I figured because it said only at night, but it's even worse. How about Primo moves? I mean, it still glows a little, but nowhere near as much. And then, even then, it wasn't glowing that much to begin with at night. Wow, color me disappointed in this skin. All right, so I'm just gonna check it in a match real quick, a live match, and then I can check the replay. This is what I wanted. Something like this. I mean, obviously not that powerful, but who's shooting at me? Something 
a little stronger than what we actually have here. All right, we've almost got complete nighttime. Oh, there's the beams. Okay. Now it's looking a little better. I don't know why. I was in Battle Lab in complete darkness. And it didn't do this, as you guys just saw earlier. Let's just box up. So, as you can see, now from an overhead perspective, you can see the beams. That's what I wanted. That's how it should have been. Let's do old school. Oh, yeah. Okay, so that's much better. Still, from your perspective, you're not going to be seeing any of that. Although, I guess when you're running, you can kind of see it as your head weeble wobbles from left to right. Let's go inside the bush and see. There, that's better. Yeah, that's that's a lot better. So I'm assuming enemies can see this as well. Maybe not this prevalent, but I don't know. I guess he's only 1,200 V-Bucks. If he was 1,500, I'd say heck no. Absolutely not. But this has got to be probably the worst reactive skin in the game. In my opinion, that is. Oh, I see the Chug Jug over there. Let's see if we can get one kill with this terrible skin. Okay, someone... Someone's got to be over here, right? There he is. Wowee! Anonymous, by the way. Hey, brother. Bop! So it looks like, at least in replay mode, that it's not noticeable to other people. As you can see, you don't see that beam effect shooting out from the top angle. Which is, I mean, that's good. But from your perspective, you can see the high beams. I don't know, I still think this is one of the worst reactive skins in the game. Oh, those creepy things on his arm there too. Ooh. I don't know. I saw a lot of people say that this is a good looking skin, but I disagree. I think the beams should be way, way brighter than they are, especially if the enemy can't see them, just like you're seeing here. If that's the case, they may as well be those super, super high beams that shoot out. I mean, if nobody can see them, that's how I think it should be. But instead, this is what we get. I mean, it's not a bad skin, but it's not a good skin. If I had to rate this one, I'd say 3 out of 10 with the worst reactive feature in the game. That's about all there is to it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. A like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which by the way, is TaborTime.